recall that we have this weight update that we are calculating during the backwards pass. So we'll just paste this in here. So we have this weight update that is calculated by gradient descent via backpropagation. And this weight update is then going to be used to update the, the current weights in the network. So specifically, we take the old weight and subtract from it the weight update value. And then this difference is what is going to give us our new weight. So for each weight in the network, we calculate the weight update value with gradient descent. And then we subtract that weight update from the old weight value. And that's going to give us our new weight value. So this entire process of using gradient descent to calculate the gradients of the loss with respect to the weights in the network and then update all of the weights in the network happens over and over again in an iterative fashion until all of the optimized values for the weights in the network have been found, which lead to ultimately the minimized network loss. So we should be able to see where gradient descent gets its name now as it's updating the weights with the calculated gradients of the loss function with respect to those weights as it descends towards the minimized loss. So there we have gradient descent.